Oscar is in a, a film museum called Acme in uh, Melbourne. I, I get to pay a ticket and see it every now and again. <laughs> well, I've got two, and people come and they always want to pick them up. And my la the dance, I have a very humble abode in London, and the loo is full of my daughter's art. So it's full of my most precious possessions. So it's not as if I'm being rude. I just keep it on the shelf somewhere near the television set. Put it in the refrigerator. No, I don't. <laughs> I, I, well, I have them in like bookshops, you know, sort of with my kids' trophies for soccer. You know what? I've created a, 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 a wart wall. And it's a, actually a hidden wall. You don't realize it's a, it's a wall. And it goes into my futuristic office. This is the truth. And it sits right there in the middle of all the other walls. And it says, ah! Oh, it's in my um, it's in my living room. My son knows. That's, I'll let him tell you if he if he wants to tell you, but it's his and he knows where it is. And it's not used as like a ramp. Or a, <laughs> it's safe, but he knows. <laughs> I keep my Oscar in London actually because um, because he's rare in London, and so um, I, I thought that I would I take him back to London. I have this place that stacked high, um, you know, uh, shelves, glass shelves, and I just keep all my awards in one place. It sounds kind of cheesy, but they look quite nice there. Um, I keep it kind of tucked in a shelf that betrays some lack of self-esteem, so I feel it needs to be slightly out of the back of the corner in the dark, so I'm working on that. Well, right now it's in a box because <laughs> I'm, I'm moving house. So, uh, but it'll it'll be back in its sacred place on my mantle.